what is the remainder when 91 92 93 etc etc 99 is divided by 1 to 6 1 so 91 into 92 into 93 into 94 into 95 into 96 into 97 into 98 into 99 divided by 1 to 6 1 okay here I need to write 1261 has multiples of two numbers or three numbers whatever it is. So I need to find out the factors of 1261. So 1261 is not divisible by 2, 4, 8, 6, 10 or 12 because it is an odd number. So that's all are gone. Okay. Then we'll what is the sum of the digits of 1261? 1 plus 2 is 3, 3 plus 6 is 9, 9 plus 1 is 10. So since the sum is 10, it is not divisible by 3 or 9. Because in order for a number to be divisible by 3, then sum of digits should be divisible by 3. Similarly, if a number is divisible by 9, then its sum of digits will be divisible by 9. Okay. Then it is also not divisible by 5 because last number is 1. A number is only divisible by 5 if the last number is 0 or 5. Right. Now we will check 7. Okay. In order to check for uh, what is the divisibility rule of 7. So 1, 2, 6, 1. Whether it is divisible by 7, what you have to do? We have to uh, double the last digit. So here double the last digit is 2. Then we have to subtract 2 from the rest of the number. So we'll get 126 minus 2, we'll get 124. Then we need to check whether 124 is divisible by 7. So similar, same uh, way we'll do it. Okay, so 12 minus 4 into 2 is 8. It is 4. So 4 is not divisible by 7. So 1261 is also not divisible by 7 then 8 we have uh, 8 is not uh, uh, divisible then uh, we have 9 9 is also not divisible then we'll check 11 so what is the divisibility rule of 11 we have to sum the alternate numbers then get their uh, difference so here 1 plus 6 minus 2 plus 1 so that is 7 minus 3 we'll get 4 4 is not divisible by 11 so 1261 is also not divisible by 11 now then we'll check 13 okay so 1261 divided by 13 13 into 9 is what is 13 into 9 13 into 9 is 117 so that is 91 13 into 7 is 91 okay 13 into 7 is 91 so 1261 is equal to 13 into 97 so 1261 is equal to 13 into 97 okay so 97 97 got cancelled and 13 into 7 is 91 so what we can see here this became 1 okay so what we can see here is that the numerator, numerator is exactly divided by divisible by the denominator right that means uh, the remainder is zero so the option d is the correct answer so what you have to uh, know here is that usually these kind of questions in this kind of questions remainder will be zero okay so upsc is trying to check whether you can find it okay but it's not always correct but normally in this kind of questions there is a high chance that the answer is option is zero because there, uh, there is a high chance that the numerator is exactly divi divisible by the denominator. You just need to check. Okay. You just need to check whether you are getting 0 or not. That's it. Okay.